You have been selected for the s oh for the seven wild dates romance-based reality show. If you choose to participate, you will be tasked with having seven consecutive perfect dates while hitting cameras record your every move. He's spouting the memes and she's fine with it. I feel like she's like maybe perfect for him. Wait, and she <laughs> and she slapped him after that. That's crazy. He kissed her and then we got slapped. Love that for us. Um, hello and welcome to The Sims 4 Love Struck. This is the second episode. If you didn't catch the first episode, it will be on the card on screen. I don't know what direction it's gonna be. Maybe that way, I think. Yeah, it will be on the card on screen and the playlist will be linked in the description below. So go check it out. It, it, last episode was crazy. It was crazy. It was a lot. We are greeted here by, um, by a message from Vlad telling us that we have a nice neck, which honestly we do. Follow up results. Oh, Elvis was sick last episode. Like, there's a lot to catch up on. Um, Elvis results are in. It seems Elvis has de developed an allergy and should schedule. Oh my God, can I speak? And should schedule a follow up visit for more information. So he was feeling like terrible last episode, and um, Jody here is still on her date. Yeah, she is. It is 3 a.m. She's still on her date with Geoffrey Landgrab. So basically what happened last episode, um, I introduced you guys to the family. We have Elvis here, our beautiful baby who just, you know, he just finished school. He just finished school and he has moved in with his mother in the beautiful world of, um, what's it called again? Sudad? Swiss? I'm just going to call it Sudad because the name is so long. As I said before, as is common in maybe African communities, I don't know. But his mom is just... All she wants now is for him to settle down, you know, burst out the grandkids, you know, love that for us. And he has been very unlucky with love, as last episode proves. His aspiration, we went with the romantic explorer, so he does want to find love, but it just it just doesn't work out. Um, first of all, I would say it's because he's romantically reserved, which means they often care tread carefully in the realm of love, preferring to take their time and build solid emotional connections before jumping head starts head first into romance and that didn't work out in the last episode because we actually went on a date with miss monica here as you can see everything's neutral but this happened that was it was so crazy Flashback. he's going in with the romance interactions which stop stop it stop it stop it what is this oh it's a oh my god end of flashback like having a first having woohoos on the first day is something else but having like that was literally the first thing they did on the day they met introduced themselves and they were like yeah let's go in the closet it was absolutely crazy and then we got drunk we pissed ourselves it was a terrible day i'm just i'm not going to lie to you and then we got back home to our beautiful mother and she got axed out by Joffrey Landgrab. So yeah, he said he was going to give us gifts. He did. He gave us a few gems. But now they're just, you know, they're just having fun. And honestly, I'm just going to leave them to it, honestly. I also went and did a little bit of research on Miss Monica here. And I found out a bit about her law. Like, it's a lot. So basically, her husband left her to be a gnome artist, I think. Yeah, a gnome artist. And now she's back in the dating scene. And then she's actually in love. I'm not sure if she's in, she's not in a relationship with him yet. But you know the guy from the trailer that she was, you know, having woohoos with? Yeah, she fell in love with him. But the plot twist is he went to high school with her son. So he's like half her age, maybe. And like, it's just, it's just crazy, honestly. And you know, that household has a lot to do. So I'm probably gonna stay away from Monica. It seems like she has a lot in her hands. But what I am gonna do right now, we do, we are in a tech guru career because it makes sense from him. He's just a little, you know, he's just a little nerd who likes to play games sometimes. So I'm gonna get us a computer. We can barely afford it, but you know, we, we can fit it in. We are down, we are down to 207 simoleons. He has working four hours, but uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to get him to go to the hospital for his allergy issues. And hopefully mom gets back, honestly. Hopefully Jody gets back from her date. She has been there for a whole long time. Elvis has been diagnosed with general allergies. Sims with general allergies can become uncomfortable in the spring and summer, when around flowers and generally going about their lives. They can also have negative effects if they are indoors in a place with too much dust. 
allergy medication can help take the edge off so we need some allergy medication i can't figure out which one to get him oh okay i found it l l l l oh we can't afford it actually guess that's fine jody's out here just discovering all just discovering all the skills discovering all the talents i'm gonna get him to finish up that soup glad we got to catch up i mean we are catching up i would say she's asleep asleep what okay i mean last time we got called and we we actually met him up in the woohoo hotel but yeah that's crazy and i actually just realized something they're, they're actually functional bus stops not really functional but you can travel from these bus stops and it's 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 kind of cool okay at least she's actually um taking care of her needs so she can just get to work immediately 12 seconds later feelings it's it's okay like it's girl we have things to do you're rich we're not we need to get to work okay we can't just be going on constant dates with you relax geek on tray oh we can actually go to geek on i don't think he has any no way <laughs> wait there's actually no way there's actually no way but he's going to work there's actually no way so this is monica that i told you guys about oh lilith is sleeping it's 10 a.m babes i guess it makes sense because she's a vampire that's so awkward she literally comes to welcome us it's um monica which we had the terrible date with and that's her son who is like the friend or like the classmate high school classmates of her like boy toy or like boy lover or whatever it's just absolutely crazy okay so while they're both of both at work i kind of wanted to check out the turn on and turns what the f the turn ons and the turn offs so we have romance styles oh these are like um love languages woohoo physical intimacy affection flirting gift giving um ambitionless ambitious argumentative cerebral what's cerebral oh like smart babies egotistical clean i don't know what happened but he kind of bugged out of work now we're stuck in this awkward situation um i restarted my game and she also got bugged out of work so i guess we are not we're not making any money today so and we are back in this very awkward situation <laughs> he's so done he's so done with me i think we find him just giving up like on the relationship with her like our friendship is even going into the red i think it's just lost at this moment she is so done with us she's so done let's actually introduce ourselves to her son okay i'm gonna refresh the matches i'm gonna look for more matches okay we have rain an adult child of the ocean klepto maybe not uh myla from windenburg she's cheerful is a, and this is a turn on for elvis and she's good luna why are we just getting the the adults and the elders she's romantically reserved which is the same as us which will make sense but she's gloomy and he finds that as a turn off nicolette another elder what is with the elders another elder shanice l Ooh, El Faba. I'm actually down for that. And any day, any day. Skylar, non-committal, and she is cringe. Wait, she is cringe. That's kind of perfect for us. So we have two matches at the moment. I'm gonna ask to create a date. Oh my god, is she always sleeping? Like, what's going on? okay so part of our expiration is that we want to get to go on a get to know you date so i'm gonna go with this one um host dates do we bring a guest that would kind of be crazy that would be kind of crazy i want to see if they actually react like poorly to this so i'm gonna no not no not monica i'm so sorry not monica let's bring jody should i Please, no. Thank you. I'm gonna bring Jody and then events. Um, 
we're gonna do friendly we're gonna do funny we're gonna be romantic i mean i'm gonna remove that one since he's um romantically reserved i'm gonna get food drinks honestly maybe drinks are not a bad idea after the last day um star or cloud gaze could be fun save the moments maybe some dancing yeah and then where do we go i mean we went to the lounge last time so let's go to the nightclub this time it's our second try at this whole dating thing we are here at the nightclub we but this time we <laughs> this time we brought our mother and honestly i'm gonna just keep them out of her way or keep her out of their way not him going to talk to his mom first let's go see our date i'm loving those boots them cc boots she she's she's here to she's here to slay where is she going okay we need to talk about dancing yeah let's talk about some carefree dancing why is he talking with her like forget about your mother leave your mother alone okay um i'm gonna get her to go to the bar honestly like she should enjoy her time um let's order her favorite drink okay so this is going a bit better than before let's ask about some online photos and them being both romantically reserved is like it it kind of makes sense well we actually got something different she's unemployed but we also got attraction changed elvis has learned more about skylar and is now attracted to her I kind of like the fact that it's not only physical, like you kind of need to get to know them first. Okay, I'm gonna get them to watch the sky. Sachido. You have been selected for the s oh for the seven wild dates. Romance-based reality show. If you choose to participate, you will be tasked with having seven consecutive perfect dates while hitting cameras record your every move. If you complete all dates perfectly, you'll be awarded with the grand prize. By signing up for this, you consent to being filmed for the next four, for the next week. Okay, sign me up. The hidden cameras are already outside your window. Don't bother looking for them. They are really small. Get dating. Wait, I'm kind of confused. What are we meant to do again? Elvis has opted to participate in the wild new reality TV show, Seven Wild Dates. You must have at least one perfect date by the time this mood expires to keep things going. Apparently they are hitting cameras, but Elvis doesn't notice anything. So we kind of have to we have to have seven perfect dates. So we have to get to it. So I feel like they are actually kind of working him and Skylar. I might go into casting, you know, sp spruce her up. Okay, so basically we have to have like a date like every single day. So I'm just gonna keep going into um, into Cupid's corner. I'm gonna keep re um, refreshing for matches, and then we'll just keep going. 20 minutes later calm down you're having way too much fun oh ask the seductive dance okay i'm gonna just finish all the friendly interactions first and there is a new lot trait this um this law actually has that lot trait so basically more single sims will tend to like be here so i'm just gonna get this date out of the way and we'll see what's next looks like elvis just befriended a family motivated sim family motivated sims tend to put family first and often play or often enjoy spending time with children in terms of yeah i guess he could like family motivated sims or oh, she's breaking it down i feel like this date is going really well they haven't gone like romantic or anything there are no romantic interactions but he is feeling very flirty mind you he's doing this like very exhausted and I actually didn't notice, I actually forgot that we actually had um, Jody here with us. Her hygiene is so low. Wait, what? Why am I seeing just romance bars everywhere? Okay. No, she doesn't have. But she does have romance with Joffrey though. Maybe we'll explore that later. <gasps> no, 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 no. The date's about to end. I do want to get a uh, three-star date. Oh, ask to, uh, ask to extend dates. And then I will also ask her um, how the date is going. How she thinks the date is going. No, 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 no. It's about to end. To ask her to extend the date. Please, Elvis. Please, 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 please. No, please, 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 Elvis. Oh my God, now she's on her phone. 
please ask please i don't want this date to end ask to extend dates okay he's finally asking oh yeah and she's down for that she's down i love that okay more time for the rendezvous i'm gonna try oh did she just recently <gasps> they finally got their romance bar okay i'm gonna try and get these like interactions done I'm gonna spout some memes. I'm gonna be silly. Oh, I mean, need to take a photo as well. Maybe we get a photo wall for all our dates. That's kind of weird, but I'm gonna do it anyways. He's spouting the memes and she's fine with it. I feel like she's like maybe perfect for him. One feature this pack has is that the NPC Sims can actually like in like initiate the interactions. They can actually initiate like getting together as a couple and stuff, which is just really nice. So she asked to extend the date more she's having the best time and this is actually really nice i feel like she is she has gotten herself a cc makeover because i feel like this date went really well oh we got it we got a perfect date we want to dance we want a small talk but i feel like it's finally time like he is done he is he is passed out his mom is watching him and i actually like the fact that I don't know if it's meant to do anything like in the trailer but she just stayed back she didn't interact with any of them she was just great honestly she is feeling a bit dazed she's starting to burn out what's this interaction um that's a language mod thing and i kind of like the fact that she didn't she didn't do anything she just sat there and watched and when he's done dancing where is she Miss Skylar, there she is. I'm gonna get him to end the dates. Um, what's it? Ask to wear a couple's costume. Oh, okay. I'm gonna ask. So we're gonna end the dates cheerfully. Gold, get to know you. Date complete. Gold medal earned. It was perfect. I'm not sure. Um, it still says zero out of seven wild dates. So I don't know. I don't know if we completed that, but we're gonna head home. Wait! Oh, that was a mistletoe kiss. And she and she slapped him after that. That's crazy. He kissed her, and then we got slapped. Love that for us. And we're gonna go home. Oh. Seems like curved rooms or curved walls are still broken. Curved walls are still broken. Ooh, it's Skylar. I've been thinking of getting a new job. What do you think? Yeah, I think you should try a new career. You know, go for it. I feel like we'll probably see Skylar again, but it's too soon to be sure. And for some reason, this emote still says we have zero out of seven wild dates. Even though we had the perfect date last time. Oh, a nervous client enters. Their friends have finally convinced him to go on a blind date. They're not sure what to do since this will be their first date in a long time. They think their friend's date choice will make the date go horribly wrong. So they prepare for the worst. Go for the blind date, see what happens. An irate customer contacts Elvis, demanding a refund on her new smartphone. You could just give the customer a refund and get back to the game he's been playing. Or try to calm her down and talk her through the problem. Let's do some... Ooh. Oh, this is kind of weird. I heard he became friends with Skylar. She's pretty cool. The day was a complete disaster. Those two sims couldn't have been more different. And the client is annoyed that they trusted Jody's judgment. No, you didn't have seven perfect dates. So yeah, sorry, no money. However, this drama is gold and has Skyrim. That's crazy. That's crazy. I got them like views and then I don't get anything. I don't know why our date didn't count. Maybe because we were already on the date when we got the opportunity. So that's really sad. If we get it again, I'll, I'll try again. I'll try again. Okay, I'm gonna actually start this like dating wall thing. I know it's weird, but I just kind of want to do it. So we have one with Monica. And then we have one with, um, what's her name? I forgot her name already. We also have... I'm gonna sell the rest of these. Oh my god! I hate when Sims, instead of actually doing the interaction, they just sit there doing like stupid animations. Now he's gonna fucking piss himself. You deserve that. 
Ach, you deserve it. You're so embarrassing. <laughs> You're so embarrassing. You dumb... Oh my god, I'm just done. Bitch, get back here and What do you mean? Get back here and mop this stuff. <gasps> Ooh! She axed this out. She axed us out. Oh, I'm actually getting excited for this. I actually sent him to the doctors because he is feeling sick, which I'm I'm so done with that. But the date is more important, obviously, at the bluffs. That's crazy. That's like that's like woohoo level like dates. Maybe it will happen. Maybe it won't. We'll see. We are at the bluffs. And since this is our second date, I feel like it is finally time that she gets a CC makeover. It's like she she's earned it. And there it is, the new, the improved Skylar Leggett. She has, like, the weirdest traits. She's a rancher, she's a goofball, and she's cringe. And for some reason, her aspiration is spellcraft and sorcery. But yeah, this is... This is Skylar. I tried to give her, like, the adult look with some of, like, some new, like, wrinkle CC I got. I kept, like, the same bun-up hair, and, like, this is just the general vibes. Back on our day, I don't know how good this is going to go... Because we are, we are like really sick. Um, what do we even do in the bluffs? It's been so long since someone has invited me. So okay, we swim. No way. <laughs> no. No. Wait, what happened? The day got cancelled. I mean, obviously, because you went in a bush to sleep, bro. I think he's messed it up, and he still wants to chat with Monica. I feel like he's hung up on Monica, I'm not gonna lie. That's actually crazy. He was on it. That's crazy. That's literally so embarrassing. I filled a, a whole entire outro and I wasn't recording. But but we go back from the doctors. He he's going through it, but he can he's honestly gonna get over it. I don't know why he's so sickly. We got some antibiotics, some penicillin, and hopefully that's gonna help him out. Um, they're both feeling uncomfortable. She's going through menopause. I think this mod is kind of being a bit too much. I might take it off. Who knows? But I feel like there's something wrong with my game. We went on a very beautiful date with the uh, beautiful lady Skylar. We also fucked up the second one because we went to sleep in a bush. And we did get do a get to know you date. But for some reason, it isn't updating. And going on loading screens cancels careers and cancels events. So I feel like there's something wrong with my game. And I am going to try to sort that out before the next episode. But that is all I have for you guys today. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like and a subscribe. And YouTube thinks you're going to like this video. So save their eyes and I'll catch you guys over there. Good damn bye.